Hello beautiful people and welcome back to She Cares. As the title suggests, digging in to our beauty favourites. Eek! She Cares Beauty is about being you on purpose and I hold space for that because that's the space I hold for myself. I've been on the journey of becoming me over a lifetime. I have learnt a thing or two about beauty and about me. I was diagnosed with an autoimmune disease the year I started a new beginning. With all of that fresh revelation, I decided that I was going to decide what happens in my life. So I took the brave, bold choice, leap of faith. My plan for my life is to change my lifestyle choices, to start to reflect the needs that I have for my autoimmune disease, my healthcare issue, to not seek medical support with this immune disease. As we deep dive into this, because <laughs> if you know me, I am not here for the shallow shit. Just gonna keep it real. There are layers to you. These are the things that complement our life choices. Beauty isn't supposed to hide us, it's supposed to allow us to be more of ourselves. That's why we're not out here looking to dwell in the shallows. We're looking to go deep. Today, here, we're looking at our soul health care. Beauty marks tell a story about your beauty. The marks on your skin to the marks of your scars, they express what a beautiful life you've had. I am so excited to share with you the things that I've found, my beauty wins of 2023, that focuses on holistic health. Big, big business today, big. Brings me to neatly wrapping that section up. This is my January reset happening in February because I fast in February today. Wrap it all up. She's on back. I have focused this beauty haul. I did my restock of my favourite. Enhancement, testing and restocking. Okay. Those are my thoughts when I was doing the clickety click click. Also, in line and in tandem with this whole marking of a new era with the Beauty Mark series, I actually bought a new product line that I would like to talk about in depth, more about prevention rather than cure. I personally have hyperpigmentation. I described my journey in starting She Cares Beauty, but I believe there is a base to everything. When you base your makeup routine, your foundation looks absolutely flawless. This was my baseline restock. Okay. <laughs> I have stuff that I picked up from Amazon and Amazon bane of my life. So these things from Amazon are just to supplement this big old. <laughs> just to say, accessibility is extremely important to me, and there are varied price points in this box. I just want to say this: when we are in those down seasons where we may not be where we want to be. We may not be able to buy the things that we want to buy, etc. You need to have a baseline even there. Rock bottom does not have to be dark. There can be light there, okay? <laughs> From my lips to God's ears. This is just living because we forget about the rest of the stuff, especially with this autoimmune. Listen, no more prolonging days, okay? Aging is a beautiful thing, okay? We're living, thriving, surviving. <laughs> but I'm gonna run through this so quickly because I do not want to be here forever. It is a real haul. <laughs> we will start off with the essentials. Essentials. My cotton wool ovals. Yep, we have the oval ones here. These I use more for skincare products. And then we have my squares and then my small ones. These are more travel products, but essentials nonetheless, because you don't know what size and stuff you may need. With the square ones, I do use these multifunctionally. I can half these literally because they're so big. And then I can use half for my skincare products. And then I can use half to take off my makeup. Say if I forgot makeup wipes or there was just nothing available. That works wonders. So having these in my travel kit is just absolutely necessary. Love it for us. Next, we have sanitary towels, okay. Oh, 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 These, these, these ones, these require a bit more intel, okay. I'm sure we've all watched in the movies when a man has to go 
to the drugstore, the beauty supply, whatever you want to call it, go and buy your lady sanitary personal hygiene products. I had that moment at big old 30, at big old 30. <laughs> During my year, I was on a career break, got a chance to just really know me and like, what do I like? What do I not like? And this buy, I loved it because it was like my personal, personal happiness. I figured this out. Oh, I'm 31 now. 31. I won. But yes, I cracked the case. Sherlock. Okay. We have wings, no wings, flow. Those three principles are what guide your decision making. Do not just buy something because it is popular to buy or it's what's available. You will be annoyed when your time comes. And that menstrual cycle is cycling. The things that stop me getting stressed, this was that buy for me. It's doing what it wants to do. First up, night pads. Every living woman needs to have this. If you bleed, buy it. Wings and the heaviest of flow. First one. Second, this is no wings, heavy flow. The one down. Length, also very important when it comes to your flow. Ultra long, without wings, when you are going out and you want to have protection, but you do not want the trouble of the wings. Say you're wearing a dress, all of that good stuff, and you're heavy on your period, she's got you. Then we have the regular flows, okay? just regular ones with wings ones without i believe yeah it's just when you're on your period probably at home for me personally it's just either one or or then we have regular flow again and this one's with wings so we have different options for different needs and different spaces i'm very much a homebody person so these things complement me using tampons like when i go out panty liners like they there are options within the options right that's that, that that that's that next up we bought a shaving stick only really bought this because it goes on the wall we'll see how it goes i've never used it before let's see if venus is venus in mm -hmm. okay i mean antiperspirant please smell yourself okay you do and can smell yourself please smell yourself okay we don't want you to be fresh like that out here please. <laughs> so I bought this. I've never used Mitchum before, but supposedly Mitchum is really good. I use this under spray and then I use the spray on top after I've let that set for a little bit. That's if I'm going out, out, out. I think that I might sweat. There's activity. I like adventure, that sort of nature. But if not, I use one or the other, a roll on or a spray. It's either or, but I think you should always have both in your personal hygiene kit. Next. cannot live without these cotton buds cotton tips whatever you want to call them the cosmetic ones and they've got like the little little thing at the end help you with like under your eye or the round bit even for a cut crease works very well then we have just the normal round ear ones whatever you use it for to get those things out of wherever it needs to come out of <laughs> so this is just my restock of my electric toothbrush heads um i bought a new one this time it's cross action i bought one before and it had like plastic bits in it um, it hurt my teeth, didn't like it until I, it like wore down. So this for me has no plastic bits in it, which was supposed to be the better choice, but it just, I just didn't like it. Let's see how that goes. Bam. With soul care, self care, health care, okay, holistic health care, you have to look at yourself and see yourself. And I did. <laughs> The walk with me is a said done piece of work art may i add i've had to edit them this year and i've been looking at myself a lot more and i've seen that my eyes are extremely puffy that also relates to my autoimmune disease this has been a testing buy but also like i said a holistic healthcare lifestyle choice change i suffer from hyperpigmentation anyway so these are perfect for the testing period of what works for me beauty skincare health wise their vitamin c their boots accessible testing brightening hydrogel eye mask for my hyperpigmentation vitamin c is a must as you will see with all of the products coming up so this brightening piece and just putting them in the fridge will reduce my puffiness naturally and we will see then if 
it's a medical or a science thing that I then need to consider later on. So we have a bunch of wipes. I'm not even gonna get into that. Cucumber, do your thing. So that wraps up the first part of essentials, healthcare, beauty, skincare products. A lot of those are baselines from our testing as well. So we will do reviews as and when we go. Like, share, subscribe. Don't just keep this to yourself. There's good things coming. Don't be a gatekeeper. Do your thing and I will do more. Okay, it's a partnership. <laughs> as we kick off the skincare, I believe in a five step skincare regimen, cleanser, toner serum or skincare issues so whatever that step is there for you then we have our moisturizer and we have sun protection that could be five or it could be six whatever you need i don't believe it's more than this i live a very minimalist life and very to the point does it do what it says on the tin does it really well, I'm gonna test that, okay? I listen, people have allegations out here, good and bad, and I am here to test your case. That's that. Okay, so then we have skincare wise, yeah, skincare wise. <laughs> this product, this, this holy grail set this whole haul off. I ran out of this and I was looking for it like crack. Okay, crack. <laughs> it wasn't in my local boots, and then I went to another boots. It still wasn't there. I said, okay, it's time to go online. Time to hit the online store. This toner is genuinely life changing. I have searched high and low, up and down for years for a very good glyconic toner. I've tried Soap and Glory, I've tried Boots, I've tried Paula's Choice, I've tried, oh my goodness, I've tried my cell i've tried everything okay why is this important for me because glycolic is essential when you have hyperpigmentation and that skin peels your face for you but very gently it's able to be used daily and also suitable for sensitive skin my hyperpigmentation is not specific dark spots is actually my uneven skin tone throughout my body my face gets it the most because obviously we can see each other i'm absolutely okay with it because i love myself you can set me apart and tell me i'm me if i couldn't see me but i have to manage it this is part of the beauty marks it marks my beauty it's got watermelon extract in it so i think that does a thing regardless i love some watermelon highly recommend this to most it transforms your skin right before your eyes precept upon precept layer upon layer i use it before I go to bed. And when I wake up in the morning, I genuinely look like I've stepped out of the ocean as a sea goddess. My skin just looks like sun, juicy, hydrated, giving, all the way giving, okay? You can use it in the day, but you will see in a minute, I just don't need to be layering things like acids on acids that are part of the same complementary line. Love the Revitalift line, okay? I do, but there's things in it that I just didn't need. And I have some leftover stuff, but this one is a staple forever. I've tried so many and I'm just telling you now, just do it, okay? Now we are on our skincare core regimen range. L'Oreal released a new product line called Bright Reveal. This product line I feel like was made with me in mind, but does it do? what it says on the tin that's the key question here and so that's what i will be testing in this next quarter if i don't see any results by six weeks and i haven't had any sort of allergic reactions or breakout i will try it again for another six weeks three months of testing something out to really see if it works usually i see results between three and six weeks the toner listen that toner does things by itself so you'll see a result literally tomorrow our cleanser our first step this is the bright reveal spot fading l'oreal i'm not gonna lie i've i've mixed happy reviews about l'oreal i'll be fair l'oreal is that again for me accessible but they have luxury price points in the accessibility i can appreciate that more than anything out of everything but l'oreal is faithful it's a faithful ever true right l'oreal you're worth it <laughs> That's where they got me. Anyway, I don't feel like I really need this. I've got 
a Revitalift cleanser and I also use natural soap and I've made that myself. So I will use a clean beauty cleanser in the night. So this will probably be used in the day just to aid the skincare products that I'll be using from this product line. Next up, we have the serum. We have done cleanser, we have done toner, and we are now on serum or issues. Thankfully, this combines the two for me. The best thing about the Bright Reveal, which speaks to me, is the brightening and also targeting properties of their ingredients. I love it. Niacinamide is an absolute stable for people of colour. Me as a black woman, especially with hyperpigmentation, I look for that most times out of anything. This is 10%, so this is quite high. It's a good high, but a stable high. Then we have acids. Amino sulfonic acid, a gentle exfoliant to remove dead skin cells and reveal more even skin. When this thing says acid, it really means acid. I'm here for it. In one week, we have visibly fade all types of dark spots, post acne, sunspots, age spots, even stubborn ones, and your skin is brighter. I'm really excited to use this one. I'm really excited. And I love this with the glyconic toner because that's the properties of glyconic. Its benefits are that it removes that dead skin layer that just happens because your skin sheds. Next up, this is also the issues. So going forward, I will be going into a six step skincare regimen. Sadly, it's normally five and I would really rather keep it five because I like to be in bed sooner than later. Um, this one has got a cocktail of acids, AHA, BHA, PHA. Listen, I didn't even know you can layer all of that like that. That's why it's important to also buy product ranges because they know what works with what they know. I do feel like the brands nowadays do try and combine needs um, into the same product. And I feel like this is what they've done with this. In one use, skin looks immediately renewed and brighter. Second, post acne marks are visibly faded. Third, all types of dark spots are visibly faded. This one isn't used every single day. It is used probably twice, three times a week. It's gonna take away deep layers again to get back to that baseline of you. Remember, we're being us on purpose, reveal all of this glory. It already says in one use, skin looks immediately renewed and brighter. So I think that this will last me a while. We will be using this and targeting spots. I would say that come more so after my period. My skin just wants to be skinning and the spots wanna come out to play. Last but not least, we have our sun lotion, sun care. Five step, fifth step, five number step. <laughs> step number five in the whole regimen. This one's very important. I always buy a 50 something. This is for my sanity, for my peace. You just heard how I, we're doing AH, BH, PH, Glaco, kick it, kick it. Listen, your skin is going to be vulnerable. Your skin is going to be raw in a certain sense. You are shedding to newer, fresher layers. You have to take care of yourself and that's part of taking care of your health. Also has an LHA in it and vitamin E. So it's an exfoliating active. This is what I mean about the products serving different needs at the same time. That's why my regimen is so short. All of the products do all of the things that I need. The essentials are the five. Those are the essential five I am now catering towards. A lot of testing is going on there. I've also bought my restock items. I'm a faithful one, I'm a loyal one. Let's go, okay? If you tell me you need something and you need it quick and you need it accessible, this is what I will recommend, hands down. These, this, this skincare line, okay? Garnier Skin Active line, I swear by this. I won't even stutter. I won't, I won't, I won't, no. This line, we'll start with moisturizer because that's kind of where we left off. But vitamin C, already told you that's a staple in all of my products, and also has an SPF 25 combining all the goodness. I don't need to think about step number five anymore. That brings my skincare routine down to four. Cleanser, toner, serum and issues, and then my moisturizer, that's four. Love this. Then we have our eye cream, a turned 30, and that's when I believe you should start using additional products to 
maintain your skin, not to prevent aging. You're gonna age, you're gonna die, let's, let's be for real. <laughs> if you're gonna be one thing in life, you're going to age. And so this for me, I love this product because it's got banana powder in it, it's got vitamin C in it, and it's got caffeine in it. So it wakes my eyes up alongside that vitamin C brightening mask. And then on top of that, for me personally, I love this under makeup. It fills out my lines and then it also like brightens it. I mean, what else could we ask for, right? This staple, absolutely fantastic. I cinnamided it again. My eyes were a bit darker than my skin tone. We're going to address it when we can. And that does that. Just kind of like following on from that vibe. We're in step four here. Nighttime eye cream now. I love me some hyaluronic acid. It is the plumper of life. It fills those lines underneath and then it also gives you that revital lift. I'm very much looking forward to this. I'm not going to lie. It's a concentrated hyaluronic acid as well. Hyaluronic is one of my key um, cocktails of drugs gonna keep it real i love in my skincare regimen like there are some things that i think aid things just very naturally and beautifully and hyaluronic acid is one of those things for me i didn't even see this when i bought it but you can use it for your face as well so i'll be using it on my laugh lines which actually are doing me very well considering how much i laugh and 30 years consistently of doing it <laughs> next up in line with our night care routine garnier was serving Mm -hmm. This is something that's new to me, doing a whole separate night routine. It's about being more intentional, about being present with yourself. And that's how it serves me for my healthcare. Can we just night combating ducks? I want to really appreciate this because this is that whole, you know, multifaceted product that I'm talking about. Yeah, it does everything it says on the tin here. Dark spots, dullness, fine lines, all of it is visibly improved when you dive deep with this one i 100 percent recommend this to anyone and for everyone it says like you will see it immediately i actually saw it immediately top three out of everything i have bought i use this now in the day and the night time because the day serum of this the night serum knocks it out of the park first time i ever used any of their products and i was using the daytime serum i genuinely used to wake up and be like oh you look brighter no makeup nothing that's literally me waking up not washing my face oh you fat damn that's actually what attracted me to the skin active range this product hands down holy grail last but not least we have our retinol and our niacinamide pea size okay nighttime moisturizer this is the revital lift laser but the main reason i got it is for the retinol i love skin attentive orientated services and products that was a mouthful anyway this is the multifaceted product that i need to work on my conscious and subconscious i love it a life tip that you will age and i'm not trying to prevent it i'm trying to aid it that includes peels right i'm growing up i'm getting older and i truly believe you should start using retinol when you turn 30. i already know i look like a baby i don't look 31 but i know that i won so let's keep winning okay <laughs> let's keep this house in order this is what that product does for me top disclaimer and advice for this is retinol switch go slow go easy this one is a no-brainer this shit stings like a if you use too much of it you have to gradually introduce it into your skincare routine one night every other night and then eventually you can use it like you know every day if you want to. I love the fact that it's vitamin A and B together. Retinol A equivalent is the retinol and vitamin B equivalent is the niacinamide. This is a good cocktail just for the night time. That's that for me. I don't think I'll be using it every day. Simple things. So I had to buy a few extra products. Okay, oh yeah, what's in here? And the spray oh they changed their packaging now it's matte i think i prefer the matte it's a better grip you know especially when your hands are like sticky i don't know we'll see these are the holy grails don't go anywhere without them 
this is for my edges my real edges i love my real hair out it's about to be spring we have our spray the main use of this actually is for my eyebrows okay i use this to do lace wigs as well all of that this is just just perfect i use this to do my eyebrows right i pre-covid 2019 i just Sherlock cracked it got it it makes sense i use it for my edges i can use it on my real hair then i can use it on my eyebrows duh so that's why i bought this but as i went to buy this i found this ah, i found this it's upside down okay this is actually a new product they made an eyebrow product glue gel for the got to be spray i was so happy to see it and really that it affirmed my geniusness okay this i can use two in one it's gel for brows and for edges for long lasting looks it's their maximum screaming hold which is number six i love it i love it i love it i love it the, the thought behind it is just you cracked it sherlock whoever is in their team when i saw it it was actually sold out on boots or like stopped coming or whatever the case is so i went to go and find this specifically went to go and find this and amazon had it so if anyone wants to use this it's actually cheaper on amazon than it was on boots so highly recommend that and this this is a testing product from my baseline because i found my baseline they've changed the vegan formulas as well so i'm here for it well done garnier or has it got to be ah! I will keep you posted on this well done got to be working smarter not harder my motto of life well well that's it <laughs> that's that we have come to the end of my beauty skincare favorites haul with boots courtesy amazon thank you so much for coming today if you haven't already and i really hope you have like share and subscribe comment let me know what your thoughts are on the products i bought on my staples my baseline my theories my thoughts the bright reveal range have you tried it was it good got to be on my eyebrows do you agree disagree i want to hear from you wrapping this shit up and i really mean wrapping this shit up i'm not your mum that's going to be on the phone for another half an hour i love you and i'll leave you and i'll see you next time beauties bye